These are the other big stories today. With still more than a month to go before Christmas, poultry owners see no need to raise prices of their goods. Problem is, they say that they have no control over the traders who raise the market prices. For the Philippine Egg Board Foundation or Association, it's way too early to make that call, saying it is not even December yet. But if nothing can stop the price hikes, the Egg Board says the reasonable price adjustment should only be limited between 20 to 80 centavos per egg. The Bureau of Immigration deports more than 300 Chinese nationals illegally working in the country. The foreign workers were reportedly involved in an offshore investment scam. They were part of the over 500 immigrants arrested last month for working in the Philippines without appropriate permits. Local government units and agencies participated Thursday morning in the fourth quarter earthquake drill. Pasig City Mayor Vico Soto also did the duck cover and hold at the Meralco compound. Along with Meralco representatives, the NDRRMC, FIVOX, and other government agencies. MRT and PIA employees also conducted their own earthquake drill. Leaders from top financial institutions across the country are looking for better ways to make banking easy and accessible. Philippine National Bank President Wick Veloso says players and regulators should also think of ways to reach the unbanked sector. Asia Pacific Senior Advisor Michael Lohr says customers want a seamless omni-channel experience where banks can be accessed anywhere at any time. And San Juan City is set to get free Wi-Fi as it partners with PLDT Smart. Mayor Francis Zamora and PLDT Chairman and CEO of Mani Pangilinan inked the agreement today. Residents can access fast and free Wi-Fi all over the city, including in Agora Market, San Juan Medical Center, Pinaglabanan Shrine, and uh, PUP San Juan Campus. Smart will also install electronic kiosks in Barangay Halls and create a San Juan City app. We like to develop that, that relationship be closer. Uh, part of the thrust of our enterprise group is to be able to help LGUs uh, convert their cities into a, into a smart city.